a day everyone and welcome to our daily devotion. Our verse for today is in Ephesians chapter 1 verse 3 to 5. All praise to God the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ who has blessed us with every spiritual blessing in the heavenly realms because we are united in Christ. Even before he made the world, God loved us and chose us in Christ to be holy and without fault in his eyes. God decided in advance to adopt us into his own family by bringing us to himself through Jesus Christ. This is what he wanted to do and it gave him great pleasure. So Paul begins by praising and elevating God the Father first and foremost. As the Lord, as the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, he is the giver of every spiritual blessing that we have. He has blessed us with every spiritual blessing in the heavenly places through Jesus Christ. These spiritual blessings include being chosen, adopted, and forgiven. They are the gifts from God available to us in heavenly realms. In verse 4, even before He made the world, God loves us and shows us in Christ to be holy and without fault in His eyes. God has chosen to make us holy and blameless, and all because of His great love to us, His good pleasure, and His grace. That even when we were dead in sins, God chose to extend His grace to us and offer us salvation. God made that decision. God made that plan before sin even entered into the, into the world. He planned to choose us. He planned to adopt us. And he planned to forgive us. And in verse 5, God decided in advance to adopt us into his own family by bringing us to himself through Jesus Christ. This is what he wanted to do, and it gave him great pleasure. So not only has God chosen us to be made holy, but he grants us to be his children with full access, with full privileges of being his children. In John 1.12 says, But to all who believed Him and accepted Him, He gave the right to become children of God. The Lord plans for us is truly beautiful. Who are we for, for Him to choose? Who are we for Him to adopt and to forgive? We have done nothing in the Lord's plan. The Lord alone has completed the plan. It's laid out. It's accessible now. When we believe the gospel, we receive full access of spiritual blessing to the Father through Jesus Christ. And we are reminded of this verse that as believers in Christ, we are chosen, we are adopted into His family, and we are forgiven. And that's our devotion for today. God bless us all.